Hi, I'm Darren. I'm from Oxpus Alchemy. Oxpus Alchemy is a social venture in Brighton and Hove that works with people through food, nutrition, food politics, workshops and uh, body work. I'm looking to improve the workshop experiences really and I'm looking for people to be able to engage with tools that they're not necessarily used before around, uh, around food prep. I've also got a really exciting project on the horizon with the Real Junk Food Project in Brighton and Silo. And what we're looking to do really is um, transform the city's food waste into superfood for sale. Um, so what will happen is uh, the Real Junk Food Project in Brighton will be intercepting food that's meant for landfill. That'll go to my workshops and then collectively with the people that are looking to kind of learn fermentation and new skills, we'll then transform that on site in silo into a fermented product that is then going to be on sale hopefully at Hisby, which is another great food project in uh, Brighton too. Intercepting food waste is another way of just saying, grabbing that stuff before it ends up in the bin or in landfill and doing something useful with it, which is putting it in people's bellies where it belongs. To do that means having the proper equipment to kind of make sure it can happen. Um, fermenting in like mace and jars and stuff is all well and good, but uh, when you're dealing with massive quantities, you need the proper equipment and not just to deal with a bulk but also to produce a real consistent kind of uh, product as well so ceramic crocs will really help us to do that but they are you know they're not cheap when you're working in context such as food waste as well what you don't want is to be taking food waste putting it through a process and then having to waste it because it's not that great to kind of give to people. Um, you know, it's important that we use our food waste really consciously, really responsibly, put it through a process and then just end up with a wonderful kind of superfood at the end. The other part of the funding bid is to really get some cash together for um, a better online presence. Octopus Alchemy has really exploded. I think we've taught about over 500 people around food politics, nutrition and fermentation in the past year. The workshops themselves have become really exciting. It's kind of funny to think that, uh, you know, when I started this project out, it was something that started in my front living room and kitchen, speaking to about five or six people. I know the workshops are really engaging between audiences of around 15 to 16 people around. Uh, a really exciting uh, topic, which has been rebranded or reconceptualized in a sense so now i'm talking more of an archaic revival of food which is really about reviving those sustaining and nourishing principles knowledges and skills around food that have been lost to our contemporary food culture we've not only got this kind of local audience if you will but suddenly it's gone pop and you know people are engaging with us from the us from thailand from japan from australia and you know, what it seems to me that our ideas and the work that we're doing is incredibly socially useful. And to expand our kind of reach, I want something that pops more online, that uh, provides a good structure for getting these ideas out, uh, these, these, these important ideas out, and the positive outcome uh, of that being that we uh, were able to impact on, on food cultures and contacts beyond the kind of remits of Brighton and that for me is really exciting. So I'm asking for help with uh, this project is because it's essential and important uh, work um, in terms of impacting on our individual uh, lives, the lives of our communities and our environment uh, too. And not to uh, mention in terms of the projects that we're trying to get off the ground with, um, with, uh, with the turning food waste into superfood for sale, you know, that's uh, uh, going to be a really wonderful way of impacting on this culture of food waste that we have. And as a product, producing something that nourishes people profoundly, but also nourishes uh, individual projects in terms of resource and finance. So, I mean, there's so many different aspects of the, the project that, 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 uh, that, that is exciting and that is socially useful and that is definitely or should attract your cash. 
So yeah, if you do put your hands in your pocket, uh, you know, rest assured that you've you're contributing to something that is going to uh, make and affect much needed uh, change. And uh, thank you in advance. Mm -hmm.